Hello. Uh, today is March 16th, 2000, yeah, uh, 2011, here in Japan. Uh, today is Wednesday. Wednesday. I don't even know. So, uh, what's happening here in Japan? Besides the earthquake, tsunami, and then we have this accident, nuclear accident. Fukushima nuclear power plant. And uh, here in Tokyo, Tokyo is more than 200 kilometers south of the nuclear power plants. And uh, they have detected a little radiation here in, in Tokyo, but uh, very, very small doses of radiation. And the question is, what happens if uh, if there is a meltdown in the nuclear power plant in Fukushima? What happens to Tokyo? Will the will the uh, released uh, radiation be large enough? Uh, to, to actually, I don't know, kill, kill people here in Tokyo. I, I don't know. That's that's the main problem, and uh, I can't find uh, an answer to this. I, I'm looking for information about about this. And, uh, how much? How how harmful can meltdown be? There in nuclear power plant in Fukushima, and uh, some some of my my friends are urging me to leave leave Japan, and go back to Brazil. Uh, sincerely, I, I wish I could. Maybe, maybe I can. I don't know. I, I'm not sure if I have enough money to go back to Brazil. And uh, but there are other problems. Of course, I, I, I don't have a, I don't have a job in Brazil. I need to, I need to go to Brazil, go back to Brazil, <laughs> and look for a job, <laughs> look for a place to live. There are s several, lots of problems. But uh, maybe, maybe a, a good idea. I don't know. Okay, what else? Um, today was a normal day at, at work. And um, the only thing I've, I've noticed are uh, the long lines in front of gas stations. People are buying gas, and uh, there is there is a shortage of gas here in, in Tokyo, Tokyo region. I, I'm not sure if it's in in all Japan, but uh, here in Tokyo, yes, there is a shortage of gas, and uh, some. Some gas stations were closed, and a few that were open had l very long lines. Ten forty p.m. We have just had a, a quake here. It's when my apartment was, was shaking right now. It seems to have stopped. Okay, what else? Uh, Gasoline. I was talking about uh, gas stations, gasoline, and uh, the supply supply of gasoline has probably has diminished because most uh, most of oil comes from the sea, comes by by, by boat, and uh, right now the ports in this the Pacific Ocean are, are probably closed, so. I think very few, if any at all, very few uh, boats, ships, ships are coming to the ports here in Japan. So, the port, but the ports on the west side of Japan are probably open, so uh, products are probably coming from the west side of Japan. But the east side of Japan is probably closed. Most ports in, on the east side of Japan are probably closed. So there has been a shortage of uh, gasoline, mainly, and uh, 
pro probably uh, food and other th other things th things that come from abroad. Um, what else? Um, there has been a shortage of products on, on the shelf on shelves of the supermarkets, but uh, at least for now, it doesn't seem to be serious. Um, because most trains are also running at uh, partial capacity, um, the transportation of products ha probably has been slowed here in Japan. What else? What else? Uh, some people are. Some some of my friends are urging me to return to Brazil, go back, go back to Brazil, or at least leave leave Tokyo. I, I was thinking about that um, because of the radiation. In, Fukushima power plant. I don't know how much radiation can reach here in Tokyo. I don't know if th that level of radiation is harmful uh, to the human body or not. Uh, I don't want to get a radiation sickness. and uh, I'm not sure it's worth it stay, staying here in Tokyo. Some people probably live in Tokyo, but uh, on the other hand, I think it, it may be I don't know. Um, uh, over, uh, maybe exaggerate <laughs> because the amount of radiation will be probably below here in Tokyo at least. Um, in Fukushima, in the prefecture of Fukushima, the problem is serious because they are very close to the a nuclear power plant, but here in Japan, here in Tokyo, we are 200 kilometers away from the power plant, and uh, it it all depends on the winds. Um, I'm actually hoping it will rain. If it will rain uh, some days from from now, I don't know. It's very difficult to rain here in Japan. Uh, this is, um, I think, one one problem here in Japan. And uh, the air here in Japan is always very, very dirty. And uh, if <coughs> if it rains here in Japan, <laughs> the, the air would be cleaner. <coughs> because there's almost no rain here in Japan. And, uh, and the, and the rain would also uh, wash away all the radio radioactive substances. Uh, from the atmosphere, but without rain and uh, with winds mm, towards Tokyo, uh, there, could, there could be a lot of radiation here. So, but I'm not sure what kind of levels. Nobody talks about it. Nobody wants to talk about it. I, I hate this. We have to think about the worst situation. What's What's the worst that could happen? What's the worst case scenario? And uh, we have to make preparations for that. Uh, in the worst case scenario, of course, there will be a lot of radiation here in Tokyo, enough for sick radiation. And uh, what we should do, of course, is would be to evacuate, evacuate Tokyo. That that would be the actually the, the only solution. That doesn't seem to be any way to prevent. There's no way actually to stop radiation sickness. No? The only way to do. It with this problem is to evacuate, we leave Tokyo, go to to the south of Japan, or or maybe just like some foreigners are doing, just leaving Japan, going back to going back to their own countries. I could, and I, I, I could do this, but I don't know. Okay, so what else? What else? What else? Um, what else I've noticed? Um, there is a shortage of electric electric power, and uh, the company 
that runs the electric power has uh, has urged peop urged people to save electric energy, and uh, a lot of people here in Japan are uh, are with uh, the the houses. Uh, with lights with the lights off and the the streets right now are very are dark right now at night okay okay so what else, what else? I think that's all for now okay so that's all